Hi everyone, it is an absolutely splendid day for football and we're looking forward to the game. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator and alongside providing all the tactical analysis is Stuart Robson. And very excited to be bringing you action from K-League One. It's Pohang Steelers against Suwon Blue Wings. Well, thanks Derek as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. Well, here is the lineup for the hosts today. Well, on paper, they look a very balanced team. But the three advanced midfielders must at times make runs beyond the centre forward. Otherwise, they might just lack a bit of penetration. And this is the initial 11 for the visitors today. Well, the two wide players are great in 1v1 situations and their movement is also very good. But it's the midfield three that will need to control the flow of the game. And the match begins. The referee knew that was foul play, but advantage it is. And he might be through. He... And a goal! Just what the fans wanted to see. The ideal way to begin. Well, you have to ask, where's the defending? The keeper is completely exposed, but he still had to finish it, and he did it really well. It's a good goal. So underway again here, one nil the score. Sin Jin Ho. How can he take them on and beat them? And space for the cross. Cuts in from the flank. Superb entertainment. Well, let's see this again. The vision to play this through ball is superb, and he makes no mistake with the finish. He showed a lot of composure there. So back underway, following the equaliser. Well, he's lost it. Sin Jin Ho. Well, they keep working away, looking for passing lanes. Dangerous looking attack. And that is how to block. And providing width. 
space and time for the cross. Will it happen for them? Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead, but not forcing it. Can they convert? That's high-level goalkeeping. Well, that's a fantastic save. He's such a good keeper. A chance to nudge in front. Corner kick here. Can someone get on the end of this? And a time for calm on the ball. Jang Ho Ik. Bolt House. Oh, he's really opened them up here. Defended well. Pretty good reading of the game to win possession back. Could play it in. Counter attacking, very much an option. Well, it fizzled out. Well, unable to hold his run, and that's offside. An inability to keep hold of the ball there. It is a decent looking attack here. Can they forge ahead? Well, they would have done had it not been for the keeper. Well, they should be ahead now. Yes, it was a good save, Derek, but he should score from there. Over it comes. Just the clearance that was called for. And with that, the first half draws to a close. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, he stepped forward for his team with the equaliser. It could prove to be the key turning point in this contest, as they haven't been at their best today. You do feel they need to find another gear in the second half, though, if they are to go on and win it. The two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Saric. bad challenge and now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next and yellow it is a booking yeah he was too impatient to win the ball and probably deserved a yellow card Tremendous intuition to win it back. On and on he goes. And the cross is very much on.
Could be dangerous. Oh, big opportunity. He had to react and did. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. All hands on deck. But they took care of the situation defensively. Saric. Bulthaus. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Sin Jin Ho. On the offensive. Struggling to keep the ball. Saric. This looks interesting. Well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? Bodies forward and the break looks on. Failed to keep hold of it. Retaining possession proving difficult. And scope for them to produce something exciting. Will he finish? And he's outdone himself. Wonderful save there. Finally gathered by the keeper. Well, that's a really good recovery. He had to be smart there. Saric. Good visualization and execution. Keeping it moving dynamically. Can he play it in? An incisive pass. Tremendous block. Great block again. Over the byline, hence a goal kick. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Five minutes remaining and level pegging here. Can they push ahead on the closing stages? And with so little time left, that might be the winner. Wonderful drama. Well, let's look at this again. And what a one-two it is to unlock the defence. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. Well underway again, it's a narrow 2-1 lead as things stand. Well, taking into account all the stoppages, two minutes to be added on. On the attack in the closing phase. It's a neat move. The attack carried an initial threat, but fizzled out. And there goes the final whistle, much to the disappointment of their supporters.
Yes, Derek, there was very little in it for much of the game. I'm sure they feel they deserved a point at least. And it's obviously disappointing to concede in that manner so late on. But they just have to bounce back now. But it just seems that this game, he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Well, I thought he had a good all-round performance today. Only emphasised by the late winner. An extremely important moment, and boy, did he deliver.